So who could have killed Celine? Where did she go last night, Jacob? A bar, I suppose. Look, I don't know. We know that she drinks, Jacob. Drunks have regular haunts, places they feel relaxed. <sighs> Celine did most of her drinking at home. She didn't have many friends left. Not many alcoholics do. Not real friends, anyway. Okay. Let's talk and talk. When did you last see your wife, Mr. Henry? Last night. I went to see her. We talked. Things got a little out of hand. I left. Okay, in an intuition, it is. It's a lie. You know it. You tailed her, watched her come out of a bar, and then beat her to death. Admit it, Henry. Why would I do that, Detective? drunk. It was a sickness with her. It doesn't mean I didn't love her. Would you stop loving your wife if she was unwell? No, I wouldn't. Why did you kill her, Jacob? Things will go better if you come clean about it. That's a lousy thing to say. I never gave up on my wife. It's five years long. You went to her house, you fought, you beat her, she left, and then you followed her. I left first. She tried to batter me with a frying pan. I had to slap her down. Understandable. So you can prove that you came back here after you left your wife's place. I came back here, I was here all night. Start work at 6.30. Not the going out type. I schätze mal, das ist richtig. Did a neighbor see you? Yeah. Did you talk to anyone? You need an alibi, Jacob. I don't have one. I was here. I listened to Amos and Andy on the radio, and then I went to bed. We're still going to need you to come downtown, Mr. Henry. We can get this all down on paper, Jacob. How you got fed up with your wife, and how you figured killing her would bury all your troubles. Kill my own wife? It was a loss of the trap, and you just couldn't stand it anymore. Shut your goddamn mouth! <laughs> so now you're gonna tell me you loved her? Ah, the DA goes all gooey over remorse, Jacob. Okay. It doesn't look good for you, Jacob. What's this? Call it in and get a squad car dispatch and check for messages. I'll keep old Slugger here company. Telephone. Ah. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Cole Phelps, batch 1247. How could I help, Detective? I need a patrol unit to transport a suspect back to Central. Certainly, Detective. You have a message from the coroner. Do you wish to be put through? Yes, ma'am. Carruthers. It's Phelps. I've completed the autopsy. Several wounds to the head from a blunt metal instrument. Closest match would be a socket wrench handle. So the cause of death was the blunt? No, the blows to the head surprisingly were not fatal. Death was from hemorrhage and shock from the fractured ribs and multiple injuries caused by the stomping. Anything else? He's some kind of sex fiend. The 
Tissues of the anus were bruised about one eighth of an inch, but no trace of semen in the anus, vagina, or stomach. Thanks, Doctor. Any word on an owner for that vehicle? License was 2Boy8899. Yes, Detective. The plate belongs to a brown 1936 Pontiac. Registered owner is one Alonzo Mendez of 402 South Fremont Street, apartment 16. Thanks. Any other messages? One, Detective. From Captain Donnelly. He wants any and all suspects returned to Central. Interviews to be set up immediately. Got it. We're coming in. <clears throat> okay. Oh, das ist unser Wagen. Give me this much of my pop. Alonzo Mendez. Sound like a man who moonlights as the werewolf? Don't sound like a man I'd let my daughter in there. You've got a daughter. Spend enough time drinking, Cole. You'll find yourself with any number of things you don't want when you're sober. So that's why you never sober up. Exactly. What right did you have to discourage you? Brother said she took a real pounding. Maybe if he had been a little firmer in the beginning, he wouldn't be in this situation now. I imagine that Neanderthal routine is a big hit with the ladies, Galloway. Women love me, Phelps. I have no complexity. They know exactly what they're going to get. Okay. <coughs> Watch where you're driving, you maniac! Oh, I don't know what you're doing. Jesus, Phelps! Ich fahr grad wie ein Bescheuert, aber ich weiß es selber. Oh, jetzt bin ich doch falsch gefahren. Wird eigentlich zu dem Dings. Naja. Kann ja nur oben sein. Halt. Fahr ich doch. Hier, die Apartment ist auf dem top floor. Einmal ganz nach oben. Oh, wir sind schon oben. Also ganz die letzte Tür. Okay. Irgendwas finden wir hier. Was müssen wir finden? Können wir hier Cover oder was? Not everything here is going to be relevant. Wir müssen was finden. Irgendwas. Irgendwas, das wir denen was anhängen können. Moment. Oh, hallo. Circumstantial. Ah, sehr gut. Ey, wieso muss ich immer alles machen? Wieso findet der nie was? Da muss ich alles finden. Nücknarre. Was? Eine Knarre ist keine Hilfe? Bitte? Ha! Waffe! Lippenstift gefunden. Und? 
da liegt mir nicht die Waffe. System with Celine's injuries and the blood can be typed. We have the murder weapon. We better get Pinker down here. Why keep it? Why not throw it away? You think these clowns are geniuses? Thank your stars you caught a break. Captain Donald would begin to like you. Hey! What gives? LAPD, you're under arrest. Do not lose that son of a bitch. I'll go get my wheels. Mendez, stop right there. Hm. Mal wollen die abhauen. Warum? Ich doch eh nix. Wo ist er hin? Get in and drive. Verfolgungsjagd. Mann! Macht hey, der? Spin him out. I got an idea. Get him next to my window, Cole. Keep me alongside his vehicle and I'll stop the son of a bitch. Hit it. Clean this asshole off the road. Belts, you gotta get me closer. You're under arrest for the murder of Celine Henry. So. Ich habe schon gerade ein paar Schüsse und die Karre ist voll im Arsch. <lacht> naja. I ain't seen a goddamn thing. Du musst doch nicht sagen. Mordwaffe haben wir gefunden. You did a grand job, lads. Phelps, that's quite a way to acquit yourself in your first outing as a homicide investigator. It seems the city has a new and vengeful guardian. Considering the evidence against your suspect and the thoroughness with which a report was compiled, I foresee a safe passage through the courts and the DA agrees with me. Brutality on a scale such as this deserves retribution. The people and the press of this city demand. Hier kriegt geil. Hier wollt auch ein trinken, ist nicht. Hey, zwei Beweise haben mir gefehlt. Scheiße. Ey, der Verdächtige ist gefasst, auch wenn du Jacob in einer Zelle der Central Division hast schwitzen lassen. Hä? Ach, keine Ahnung. Schmetterling. Äh, ja, in dem Sinne würde ich sagen, ich verabschiede mich für die heutige Session. Wir sehen uns morgen wieder mit einer neuen Session. Wird auch wieder so in den Dreh gehen. Zwei bis drei Stunden, je nachdem. Und in diesem Sinne, ich bin euer Crazy Freak. Ich bedanke mich für die Aufmerksamkeit. Vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen und ciao.